Hey, this is Eric with Strawberry Chicks and Game Birds. Have you ever heard the term pasty butt? Do you want to know how to get rid of your bird's pasty butts? Well, this is the video for you, so stay tuned. <laughs> hey, this is Eric with Strawberry Chicks and Game Birds. Maybe you're new to bird raising, or maybe you've been reading about birds, and you've heard the term pasting or pasted butt. And maybe you want to be able to figure out how to take care of that in your birds. Well, so today we're going to show you how to ID it, and we're also going to show you how to get rid of it in your birds. Now, pasty butt is a very common thing that happens in a lot of birds. Now, they say it can be caused from different things, whether they're getting chilled or stressed. Some people say it's caused from food. It can be caused from disease later in birds, but most, most often it's just a condition that does happen in baby chicks. Uh, it's happened in many batches of my own baby chicks and I've never really pinpointed exactly what the cause was, whether, like I said, dehydration, stress, things like that. Right now we're not going to be concerned about what causes it. We just want to uh, identify it and then eliminate it. So let's get right into that and we're going to use these three baby chicks. One of them does have it and we're going to zoom in now and just show you how to inspect the birds. Okay, we're just going to show you inspecting for pasty butt right now. And what I always recommend is, you know, right now we only have three chicks in here for obviously demonstration purposes. When you have a large amount of chicks, I always suggest a box or, you know, this is just a little basket here. And as you're going through and you're checking your chicks, so we're going to turn them over and we're going to inspect the vent. You know, this vent is clean, but I put them in my, my crate here so I know which birds I've checked and which birds I haven't. It's very important that you check all your birds. So here's bird number two. I'm going to check him. He's looking good again. I'm putting him in my crate so I know that I've looked at him already. This guy is quick. Got to be quick when I'm catching this guy. And here's one. Here's a culprit here. Here we've got some pasty butt. So we're going to have to take care of this, okay? But this is how we're going to inspect him. Now, if you have a lot of birds, you might want another second tray. You put this guy over here. He's needing attention. Okay? So, now, let's go into looking at treating pasty butt. So, now that we have identified which bird has the pasting up, we're going to eliminate that. And the only tools that you really need for this, some paper towels, or just a cloth, and some lukewarm water. This is all you need to get rid of that. Okay, so now that we have identified the bird that has uh, paste it up at rear end. We're going to treat him and we're going to grab him. He's right here. Just going to leave this like this here. And what we're going to do is you can see what this is, is that's just bird droppings and it has gotten hardened up in his feathers, right? And so our strategy here is, is we're going to try to soften it with warm water. You don't want to use cold water because you can give the birds a little bit of chill with that. But you want to use, you know, nice lukewarm water. I just use a rag. We're going to start by just softening up those droppings. And what you can do slowly, so you can see, I'm just using my fingernail and I'm just picking apart this ball. And what works really well is running water. We don't have any running water here in the studio, but it does work really well. And you have to be very careful. You, what you don't want to do is you don't want to pull the feathers away from the bird. So you can see now it's kind of getting softer. It's coming apart when it, when it first starts. It is literally rock hard. You can hear this little guy. He doesn't like this at all, but you know, if we don't do this, these birds, they won't make it. So we gotta, gotta make sure that we just kind of continue on just real slow. You can see, oh, see, there's a big chunk that broke off there. And we're going to continue on. And you can see that it's really softening up now with just that little bit of water that I added. And we're just going to keep cleaning this off. And look now. Now he's got an open vent. Just 
clean that vent off. Just make sure everything's gone. I'm just gonna grab a dry paper towel here. Just gonna dry them off a little bit. Once again, we can see his vent is clear. Just gonna dry them up. Try to get rid of any of the other waste that might be in his feathers. And now he's happy as a clam. And he'll be just fine.